We can do this. We got this. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you very look, much. Look, look, our stocks are down 0.9%. I want Dank Rutherford to crunch those numbers for me in the morning. This coffee, I didn't get any coffee this morning. Where's Trixie? I want coffee and I want, a, I want a double espresso with a dash of salt, okay? Uh, Torque Spongeon, he's in accounting. He's going to be on that and take care of it. Uh, Rogan Cutney, where's Rogan Cutney? What do you mean he's on vacation? He wasn't supposed to leave till Monday. Are we on? On. Hey oh, everybody, oh, okay. welcome Sorry. to the Hello, Base I'm... Guy Show. Hi, I'm Dr. Hey, Nair Mumstead, yes. Good to, good to be with you. Okay. okay, please, please stop. Uh, we got some ch chickens running amok right now. We got a big show for you here today, ladies and gentlemen. Um, well, I'm excited. I'm excited, Base Guy. I guess everybody knows what's happening, eh, Doctor? They watched the prelude to the show. You saw the story. The rumors have been going around the world about the chickens. I broke my egg last night. Uh, Sloppy laid an egg. Jeeves chicken finally laid an egg after months of work. And so, what what does this what does this all mean, Doctor? Well, it's all about forgotten socks, you know. God loves everyone, but some people have a lot, and they want to share with those in need. So uh, that's what we got to remember. And uh, those who are suffering are like broken eggs, you know. And I see the uh, egg. Uh, dispenser unit yeah you want to see the uh where we where we're keeping the egg yeah we're going to be tra talking about the uh okay i'll just show it to here while you talk about it okay i know i'm not talking when well, i'm talking black and white can i see the uh the dispenser unit okay carefully because the holy egg isn't here here's the holy broken egg as you can see the egg has been broken the peace egg has been broken. All the shundai of the universe. And so they can't hear me. You're right. Here, you hold it. Oh God. So we have okay, the, so the the black egg, <coughs> all the shundai, the broken peace egg. See, just just even. Are you okay, doctor? Just even holding it. Release the filth, doctor. Release the filth. I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay. Okay. See, All even right. even just holding it, the doctor, <coughs> just the the power of that shunday. Oh. Oh, okay, back to you, doctor. Yeah. Talk to about the egg. Okay, okay. We release the uh, the shock. Of, I mean, the shunday filth, and we receive the shock of blessings. Oh, oh about hold it, hold that call. You'll never guess. Put it on it. hold. It's actually Jeeve. It's the chicken. It's the chicken okay, Jeeve. Okay, good. We we got time for Jeeve. He's he's a special guy. Yeah. So we're just going to put Jeeve on your camera. Hey, Jeeve, how you doing? Can you hear us? How are you, Jeeve? Yes, I can hear you. Hello, Dr. Mumstead. Hello, Dr. Basekai. So you're kind of like on this camera now, Doctor. You okay. Just look that way and they'll yes, see Yes, Jeeve. So, so tell Jeeve, me, you... tell me what, what, what are your thoughts today, Jeeve? Just open up to us well, and I have, we'll... I have a news to report on the battle against the Shunda on the egg front. Okay. Um, as we all know, yesterday an, an egg was laid, and um, it appears one of the chickens pecked the egg, opened it, and maybe ate it. Okay. So uh, th there was a victory in that an egg was laid, but there was an immediate uh, counteroffensive by the Shunda to take the egg away. Mm hmm. Okay, well, let me explain what this is all about. This is not a bad thing, Jeeve, because the sacrifices of a broken egg, a broken and contrite heart, I'll gently show you the broken egg. You see, it have been broken. So, you laid an egg, that's good news. But it's not bad news. The egg has been broken, okay? What do we have left? What we have left is, once that heart is broken, it slowly gets mended by the... Shaka ritual, we will say it now. Give me some fire. We're praying for the broken chicken not to eat the eggs. We're praying for more eggs. Bountiful harvest. We're praying for those broken eggs to be mended, to give birth, not prematurely, not prematurely, but. We're praying for protection of the egg. 
Protection of the eggs. Shaka, shaka. Protection of the eggs. Receive it. Claim it. Claim it. Receive that bountiful harvest. Shaka. Keep those dogs out of the chicken pen. Feed them right. Treat them with kindness. Let them not be afraid or startled. No roosters. I think we, we need a rooster, don't we? A rooster right now on the screen. There's there's these chickens. Okay, right we need that rooster in there. Ladies and gentlemen, this is concert. Do window. we need the rooster in or out? This is the bass guy show. You're watching the roosters and chickens live in Oklahoma. What was that, Jeeves? <laughs> Jeeves, is the rooster supposed to be in or out? There, there, there are there are no roosters. They're all hens. They're all hens. Okay. Sorry. Okay. See, we don't have a clue what we're doing. I Ladies don't know. and gentlemen, you're watching hens in Oklahoma via satellite through Montreal on the concert window. Wasn't there supposed to be a rooster in there? Didn't? It yeah, wasn't there like one rooster? No. 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 Wh which one is McNugget, oh. the chosen, the, the chosen? Yeah, uh, uh, this one, right. Sorry, Jeeves. Things are a little bit hectic here. We're full of shundai over here. We're trying to. Rig I gotta them. make an emergency call. Okay, doctor's going to make an emergency call. So, Jeev, let us know. Um, so, I shouldn't uh, believe that the broken egg is a bad sign. Because i got to tell you, going, no. out, going to the chicken coop, it, there's a weird, it, it had a weird vibe around it all, all day today. I didn't want to go to the chicken coop without... No, this, this that, isn't uh, a bad thing at all. Uh, the doctor is making an emergency phone call. What it means is that it's part of the uh, process of uh, the forgotten socks... Uh, and the cross-pollination proclamation communication situation that we have here on concertwindow.com uh, forward slash base guy is that you have to lose everything and break apart and that you, my egg and your egg broke apart means that we're both ready to have a springboard blast back together. All right. So we got the Hi, chicken Maureen. lady expert on the phone right now. You're live on the base guy show, Maureen. Really close. I can't understand you. Oh, uh, we're live on the base guy show. We need your help. What's the matter? Uh, the chickens. Is the rooster supposed to be in with the chickens or no rooster? For them to lay no. eggs. Well, he has to be in there for a while anyway. Okay, so we do need a rooster. Yes. Okay. I'll call... Because, it. Okay. because they... They, they need the stimulation from the rooster, you know, to lay the eggs, to start, at least to start. Did you catch that, Jeeve? Oh, yeah, I heard Pardon? that. Yeah. Okay, you're just talking to Jeeve in Oklahoma with his chickens. This is the chicken lady okay. expert on the phone, Jeeve. Okay, so uh, Maureen grew up on a farm. She knows oh, all yeah. about chickens. Up on the mountains, up on the mountains. <laughs> Because we, we had 250 chickens, you know, at one time, and we had three roosters in that. And they were there, they were there all the time. They had the, they could come and go as they wanted. If they didn't want to be around the chickens, then they could, you know, sort of go somewhere else, if you know what I mean. They had, they, always, they had the, a large enough place that they could uh, go by themselves. Because sometimes that, that's what they like. Well, living in, in the city limits, there are ordinances. They like to be by themselves sometimes. What's, what's that, Jeeve? Have, uh, all hens. Okay. Well, living inside city limits, we have ordinances against having roosters. You can have hens, but not roosters. It's against the bylaws for them to have a rooster. Oh, it's against yeah. the bylaws for them to have a rooster. <laughs> Uh, and I have uh, other friends, uh, other friends that have uh, hens, and they've been receiving. I, I'm receiving a. Where are you located, G? All all hell's breaking oh. loose over here, everybody. Hold on. <laughs> okay, Maureen, thanks for your help. Thanks, Maureen. Thanks. I'm gonna call you back later, okay? I'm Thank you, Maureen. Okay. Okay, bye. Okay, okay bye, Maureen. That was Maureen, the chicken expert. Thanks for that, Doctor Nair Mumstead. Uh, there's a, a lot of stuff going on here. We're gonna have to do an emergency shock. Okay, we're gonna have to do an emergency shock because, you know, either we get a rooster, then we break the bylaw. So, uh, that's gotta be a rough one. Uh, we're gonna pray for protection for that, or we have the option, by some miracle of uh, the prophet Robo Shaka Haba Haba, peace be upon him, the hens will lay miraculous eggs without the rooster. So we got two options. I don't know where to go with this, so I'm just going to give it up to the great prophet. And let's do the shock of fire tambourine of hope ritual. Okay, let's do this. 
There now, everything's gonna be fine now. Shaka, Shaka, everything's gonna be fine now, Jeev. Everything's sorted. All the all eight trillion Shundai are gone. Everyone is ready to receive, and it's a complete springboard blast back. So there we have gold ram. I'm ready to get down. Yeah, Funk Doctor's gonna do a funky dance. Maybe the camera over there. DJ Sarkov. Listen, listen, listen. Oh, 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 Diction, diction, excellent! Ec did you feel that, Jeeve? I did. Well, there, we've done it. The bass guy show, Dr. Nair Mumstead, the great Dr. Nair Mumstead. Let's hear it from him. He's once again uh, sorted everybody out. Thanks, Doctor. Well, here we have what we have left. A golden ram. A nice, beautiful white egg. That's the golden ram. The holy golden ram. So thanks for calling into the show today, G. We really appreciate it. You've made today's show. It's it's just we, we appreciate calling so much. Thank you. Well, I appreciate all the hard work that the two of you have done and easing my nerves about the situation. So we're gonna go to a commercial break, G, and we'll let you go now, okay? All right. Thanks again. Hey, nice shirt, by the way. Yeah. Let's see that shirt. Right, bye bye. Don't be speeding. We'll be back after the short commercial break. Thank you for tuning in, everybody. Lean hurt. Ah, so doctor, how you? What feeling? do you mean, the hypocritical guy's not in the studio? We need him on the show today. What? You found him behind the dumpster. Ah, oh, jeez. Larry, is Larry here? Oh, are we on? Yeah. Oh, okay. Larry, sorry. Sorry, sorry about, about that. that. Yeah, yeah, okay. we're on. Peace be upon the prophet Robo Shaka Hara Yarabaranda Bara Sabahaba. Shaka. And it's time for, uh, Can we all do a group Shaka together, like everyone watching wherever you are in your this office? Is for, uh, Psychic Eduardo, we're going to do a, Psychic Eduardo. We're going to do a Shaka meditation. Uh, okay. We're going to review our daily meditation, you know, in the, everyone, please in the join brain along. that we have the tiny receptors called bubble zoids. That unite with the innermost being, the Rafa, and the Alpha, and the Omega, and we have the uh, the transcended state, which when we release the three hundred trillion uh, sh uh, shandais, and we receive the shaka blessings, we receive the shaka morsels. They've all been saying it. They've all been sh saying shaka. Okay, shaka. Shaka. Sometimes we don't we don't have words to say, but we know that. We take the shock of morsels with gladness. We're gonna do a shock of morsel. We're gonna actually do the shaka. We break the shock of morsels into three pieces. You offer one to the prophet Robo Shaka Hayara Baranda Bahaba. Receive your shock of morsel. Eat it now. Receive it in your jazz gullet. Cleanse that colon paste. Okay, so uh, just for anyone tuning in, you're watching the Bass Guy Show, the show where a guy plays bass. Every day is different. There's no rules on this show, except for that we're here every weekday, Monday to Friday, at this time, 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for one hour. We encourage you to join the Skype team. If you'd like to join the Skype team, it's really easy. All you have to do is go onto your Skype on your phone or a computer, 
and uh, there's a whole bunch of instructions here. You can follow us on Twitter. Is it called Twitter? Twitter, Periscope, Instagram, all under the uh, mm. the hangnail yeah. <laughs> of the Base Guy Show. That's good. Um, I love that. We're also here out right now. That's Casey Morrison morsels in my taste buds. You can call in at Skype. All you have to do is add in Base Casey. Mm, that's going into my gullet. And if you want to enjoy the replays, just go on to YouTube. Oh, it's yeah. really easy. Go on to YouTube You're and just belly. search Base Guy Show and then the week's theme. Last week's theme was lemons. You'll see lemons on the thumbnails of the Lose videos. That, and uh, this week's theme is the Forgotten Socks. So if you just put in Base Guy Show and Socks or Forgotten Socks, you'll find it and you can watch the the replays there so you're watching the bass guy show live on concert window and it's brought to you by enlightenment industries that's right because your enlightenment is our business Oh, okay. Uh, okay, Sergeant. Okay, we have a new segment here that uh, it's Base Guy's favorite segment. Let me just get everything ready. Okay. Sergeant Grindstone. All right, you soldiers. It's time to get down with some coal train and some Cherokee. Are you ready, Base Guy, for your morning drill? We're talking tips for musicians. We're not talking about money. Soldier, when you get down, you gotta get up. Get back up on the horse. I want Cherokee. Give me Cherokee. One, two, one, two, three, four. That's it. Look, can't do it. Keep going, keep going. Don't give up. One more time, one more time. You're in this match. Last eight bars. Reporting to duty, sir. Well Sorry done. For my sloppy temple, sir. I must work harder. My base well is done, my instrument. Soldier. Well my done, base. soldier. My base is my instrument. I will live with my base. I will tune my base. For my base is me, and I will take care of my base. Well yes, done, sir. soldier. To towel down. Sergeant Grindstone, the hardest working music teacher in the universe, coming this fall. Learn jazz or die trying. Okay, and that was uh, that segment. Now the doctor, what, what's going on now, doctor? Where are we? Oh, let's just take a moment, a moment of meditation. I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting. I have something here to share with you that was given to me in a vision. Let me just move my glasses. Rodney was a real stickler for getting up early. His favorite expressions were the early bird gets the worm and early to bed, early to rise makes a man healthy, wealthy, and wise. As he went for his morning walks, he thought the people still sleeping were lazy. Loafers, couch potatoes, or bed lovers. He used to laugh quietly to himself, remembering the day when he was abducted by aliens. Arise. Arise, everyone. Get back on your feet. Yes, I got a proclamation to make. God is good. God is good all the time. Give him praise and glory. Let's just rejoice in the Lord. I didn't have no doubt. I 
Watching the Bass Guy Show, broadcasting to you live from Montreal. I'm Bass Guy, a guy that does the sound desk, the camera work. We've got Dr. Nair Momstead in the studio live. We have Healed Jeeves Chickens. You are watching the Bass Guy Show live on Concert Window, weekdays, Monday to Friday. We've got our good friends Mo uh, Mills Motors with us in the studio today as well. Well, he's on the chat board, so you can talk to him if you want to find out some information about great deals on cars or maybe for your friend. And we, we, we're bubbling over with a proclamation. The doctor is alive. We have released the egg. We're going to tape the egg together. Hello, Usain. Hello, Sam Monster. I got to ask if this uh, Arm & Hammer uh, deodorant is really working out for me. For all those church goers who lift their hands, you got to make sure you put your deodorant on. Your neighbor you might stank them out. I'm just going to go for a little refreshing. So you take over. Okay. <sighs> we'll be back after the short commercial break. Mills Motors, Buick GMC. Call today at 1-888-345-6295. Located in Oshawa, Canada. I'm ready. Sorry, Ryan. It was, yeah, okay, it wasn't Ryan. It was Gordon Wong. That was from the beginning, which we have heard, which we have seen with our eyes, which we have looked upon, which our hands have handled concerning the word of life. Life is manifest, and we bear witness and declare unto you the eternal life was with the Father, and manifested to us that what we have seen and heard, declare unto you that you may have fellowship with us. And truly, our fellowship is with the Father and his Son, Jesus Christ. We write these things unto you that your joy may be made full. Repeat after me. Um, our Father who art. No, 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 base guy. You didn't get it right. Do you want me to say it again? Yeah, say it once more and I'll try I'll try to get it. That was from the beginning which we've heard, which you've seen with our eyes, which we've looked upon, which our hands have concerning the word of life. Life is manifest, and we bear witness, declare unto you the eternal life, which was with the Father, and manifest to us that which we've seen and heard, declare unto you the may fellowship with us, and truly our fellowship with the Father and His Son, Jesus Christ, who these things unto you, that your joy may be made full. Queen, try it one more time now. Our Father who art in heaven, who going through the come, no, the you'll have to the get the back. Bible and the you'll have to read your Bible some more. Your broccoli and be a good boy. And I don't know it, man. I can't do it. You ask me this every day, Father, and I can't get it right. Well, patience. <sighs> patience is a virtue. Slowly, patience little by little. Patience is a virgin. Now, got spin to win. I rinse like a prince. Sometimes cold and sometimes hot. But I got something that you ain't got. I got soap, and that's no joke. Wash light and heavy and steady and ready. Got eight cycles like a cosmic bicycle. Got combos and superwash to kill the sloths, to kill the moths. The stench on your clothes will go. Cause I'm Laundry Man and I know. Hit it now. Yeah. Oh yeah, baby. That goes out to Box Guy. Re I'm bubbling over. I'm bubbling over. I feel like I'm going to give birth to a revelation. I feel like I'm, I've been impregnated. I've been inseminated with the spirit. So uh, thank you, Dr. A, for helping Jeeve and everybody with the uh, 8 trillion shundai and the chicken situation. The lines are open. If anyone wants to call in, you have to do it now. We're going to play, uh, I think, one more song take another phone call and then we'll be back tomorrow at the same time in the same place so uh, thank you so much we're gonna take a very short commercial break so we can figure out what we're doing today's show is also brought to you by Mills Motors one triple eight three four five six two nine five in Oshawa Canada best car retailer in the universe and we also have Mills Motors essence in a bottle for that manly new car smell we'll be back after this short commercial break all alone in his tiny one-room apartment. 
no friends, and nothing better to do. It was this pointless mundane existence. Decides to play bass on mine for 17 cents a day. I got it. Okay, right. go for it. The airwaves are yours. Who are you, first of all? Is that you, Zelda? Yeah. No. Hey. It's not Zelda. It's Link. God damn it, people. gentlemen so we have link on skype right now how's it going link it's going pretty awesome but i do have a message for the princess if she is listening she needs to learn how to fucking defend herself because i am sick and tired of coming to save her like come on now okay we'll try and relay that well, message like, to uh, her listen like we got to show a little love and understanding and compassion you know what i'm saying like uh don't let the shundais get you down. Don't, don't let the shundais get the better of you. You know, man. Like uh, that's right, Link. Don't let the shundai get all, you down. Uh, we've all we've all it's missed that, the mark. You know Nob, what I'm saying? Nob is on my shoulder, saying, "Hey, look, listen. That's the shundai, and I just kind of tune it out." So right is this, on, brother, is this your right first on. time, brother, watching the Bass Guy show? It is live. Yes, you've showed me the. Um, like a pre-recorded one that you've already done in the past, but this is my first time uh, actually being live on the show with you, so it's an honor. Welcome. Well, you're going to be added to the uh, the board of fame now. You want to do a little jam session? Link, Link has a scope as well, so if anybody is on Periscope, you can follow Link. Uh, Sloppy, if you know that, what's your what's your your hang nail on uh, <laughs> your 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 thing there on at Truthbringer, I think. At Truthbringer, and there's one that's like Frank T or something like that. Fingers T, that's uh, Twitter, I believe. Okay, so your fingers T on Twitter and your Truthbringer on Periscope, and uh, you play bass and you play guitar and you play drums, and you're also Link. Yeah. Oh, and I'm also uh, Shaggy from Scooby Doo. So the, I can actually, I actually want to go change now that you've seen me like this because I wanted to, you know, get on the show as Link, but it's also very, very, very hot. It's very hot. So, okay. So, because I'm outside and I got, you know, my bass way back over there. I got my guitar with me out here. I got wow. microphone. Like I told you, I got. Set up, Your I got porch set up just shop, looks like man. Sock Cop's porch. Are you sure you're not Sock Cop? And look, look. You got your fan with you. Hey, the great doctor, you're awesome, Link. The great doctor wants to jam with you. I think in the okay. key, of, the key of E, if that's okay with you. He wants to do some Hendrix E jamming with you. Okay. Um, so just play on your keyboard, me. I guess. E. The no E will do. Ladies and gentlemen, the great Dr. Nair Mumstead and Link are about to have an epic historical jam. Oh, we've lost audio on your side, Link. Sorry, I called you back, and then Okay, we're we're having some audio problems here. We can't hear you anymore, so we're we're gonna let you go now, Link. So just wa maybe I'm wave goodbye and do a little victory mountain. dance for us. I chop down with the edge of my hand. 
meet you on the next one. Don't be late. Don't be late. Cause I'm my father's child. Lord knows I'm my father's child. Take it, Jack. Wow, that was a little spontaneous improvisation. The great doctor. I don't know if you could hear, we have a bit of micro microphone problems today. We didn't have the guitar plugged in, but it doesn't matter. The essence is there. Brought to you by Enlightenment Industries. That's right, Enlightenment Industries. What do you mean? Because you're... Enlightenment is our business. Yeah, the stocks have plummeted. I don't got time for this. Are we on? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're on. Oh, yeah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah, sorry. we're on the air. Don't don't do that, doctor. Oh, I'm sorry. We're on. You know they'll hear. Yes, they'll peace hear you. be upon you, Robo Shaka. Peace, haba, yes, haba, peace, haba, peace yeah. and love. Peace and love. <laughs> oh, what a great show! Well, we got ten more minutes with you, good people. Hello, Hope I'm uh, Bank Rutherford. CEO of Enlightenment Industries, and I'd like to appeal to all of you to give to the Enlightenment Industries Mutual Fund. Uh, all proceeds go to Enlightenment Industries and the furthering of the enlightenment of the chosen ones. With a low cost of $100 per month, you can be a part of this great life-changing event. Remember, Enlightenment Industries Mutual Funds. Good for you. Good for Enlightenment Industries. this short commercial break. Thank you for listening. Does your brain hurt? I would like to thank all those who have participated in the Base Guy Show experience. Your time, creativity, and friendship means everything to Enlightenment Industries. You are the Base Guy Show. So thank you. Base Guy loves you. Thank you, Agent Banks, Amnesia Guy, Beak, Bog Monster, Captain Squid, Chris, Chuck, Club Guy, Danny, Darth Maul, Dave, Elvis, Future Guy, Gary, Gig Guy, guy said, Hockey Guy, oh, Howard, Yeah, 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 give me my coffee. Critical Guy, yeah, Inadequate Guy, Yeah, these suckers can eat this stuff up. Hey, Doctor, what the, what's the uh, down? Trixie, oh, this coffee is cold, and I wanted a double espresso. Obi-Wan Kenobi, Ollie the Ostrich, Reggie, St. Peter, Satan, Self-Loathing Guy, Shrunken Guy, Sloppy Unfocused, Sock Cop, Stefan, Steph, Talking A, T Bros, The Great Satan, The Sun, Tina, Up Ladder Guy, Velcro, and Weather Guy, and all those future people that will join the show.
It's amazing, man. Right on, brother. Totally awesome. You got the gift, man. You got the gift. You see that? That is on fire. Wow, that's absolutely incredible, sir. That's a historic jam. Only a scene on the Bass Guy show. Incredible, sir. Thank you for calling in. Wow, that was awesome, dude. Thanks, man. So what are you going to do with the rest of your day? Hey, where where can people find your where can people find your music and your your thing? What's on? Where where can people find your music and and whatever? Where can they contact you? Um, well, I have a YouTube, and that's a uh, fingers Trollbot, F I N G E R Z. So it's fingers with a Z and then space and then troll T R O O or T R O L L. B O T. So Fingers Trollbot, and that's my YouTube. I have two songs on there that I've written so far. So one of them is called Struggle, and the other one is called Jeopardy. And I love Jeopardy because of the concept of it. I came up with it. It was kind of a joke yeah, song. Like I originally, I originally wrote it like as like I originally had an idea like. Hey, wouldn't it be funny to write a metal song where like the intro is the Jeopardy theme song? And I was like, yeah. So I did it. I found it. I found out how to start it, and then it was like, it was like, you know. Then it like broke down and started getting heavier, and that was that was fun writing. And my favorite line in that song is, "Feel like I'm on trial for a crime I did not commit. I'll let you burn like Rihanna and not give a shit, bitch." You know, like that one song, like. Just gonna stand there and watch me burn. <laughs> that's all right because I like the way it hurts. Like that song, yeah. Like that's that was the fucking that was what I that's thought of when I wrote that line. I'll let you burn like Rihanna and not give a shit, bitch. So there's that, and then there's a couple of vocal covers I have on there. I'm increasing more and more. I love doing. Like, I love trying to replicate other people's voice because it's, like, a challenge to me. So, like, covers are really fun, but I do love writing my own music more, you know? So I do that with a couple of covers on the side. The one the one of the... Uh, the next cover I want to do, I actually want to make a metal a metal song, uh, Every Time We Touch. Are you familiar with that song? Uh, no, I'm not. I'm not uh, Truthbringer. Sorry. But uh, our show is going to end now because we're we're past okay. the we're past our due date, so we have to end the show now. So um, thanks for calling in and call again again anytime and watch the show and don't forget to press the follow button in Concert Window. And if okay. you go to Concert Window, you can check out all the little highlights so you can see all the different characters we have on the show. Maybe you know some of them already. Okay. Every I the just, wall is lit up with people saying they love this dude. This guy is awesome. They love how you're you're chilled out. They the good things. Go and read the comments. Everyone's loving you out there, Truthbringer. Oh man. So we're gonna have to let I, you go because uh, we're out of time now. So I feel bad oh, about wait, it, but what, we we have an agenda, you know. Thing, the egg thing. You know the egg thing that we're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I, I heard about that, and I was empathizing really bad, and I was like, give, I was trying to give off positive, good vibes, and one of the candles I was burning last night burned into the shape of a heart, and I thought that that might have been a good sign. Too. Wow, that's definitely a shaka-worthy. Shaka to you, my good friend. Shaka. And we love Link as well. Mills love Motors him. is saying he loves Link. Oh, so oh, peace, may peace be sure. upon you, and we'll talk to you soon, okay, Truthbringer? All right, take okay. care. Take care. Take it easy. Hang loose. Shaka. Shaka. 
So, ladies and gentlemen, you've been watching the Bass Guy Show, broadcasting to you live on Concert Window. Um, brought to you, uh, well, in, in cooperation with our good friend Mills Motors. And uh, Dr. Nair Mumstead is here. What, what's up? Oh, Larry, can you please? No, it's okay, Larry. Mistakes happen. Don't worry about it. It's okay. Um, what's this? What, we got a message here from the doctor. Uh, we, we don't know what this means, but if anyone can make sense of this message, please uh, get in touch with us. It's, it's very important. So thanks for watching the Bass Guy Show. Any last words, doctor, before uh, we go today? I'd just like to uh, honor <laughs> Bass Guy. This man here, the hardest working man in show business since the death of James Brown. 14 hours working behind the scenes. He's a real hero. Sponsored by Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. Good for you. Good for Reese's. Um, I'd like to honor him now. Bringing you entertainment every day. I'd like Work to honor him now can. with the medal of achievement. You've now graduated to level 700 zillion. Shaka! Let's do a victory wow. shaka for the end. We're going to do a victory shaka. Watching the bass guy show, everybody. This has been the bass guy. <laughs> Thanks for watching the bass guy show, everybody. I got an alert on my computer saying it's about to overheat. The doctor is bubbling over in the studio. We've had a really great show today. I've got eight gazillion trillion internet points or shaka points or something. Uh, be sure to check out Mills Motors online. It's definitely worth it. Come on, you must know someone out there who needs a new car or a, a, you know a bit of help getting around. This guy will help you. Please follow the Bass Guy Show. You can do this. We got this. We can do it. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye, Tom. Good to see you. I love you too, Bass Gang. Love you, my brother. Thank you, Sand Monster. Thank you, Unfocus. Thank you, Chris. Thank you, everybody. It's been a wonderful show. Thank you so, so much. None of it would be possible without you. This guy gonna be doing the stuff for you. He's here for you. He's live streaming. Bass guy, he's streaming. We may get some Dr. Nair Mustang. We may get some Satan calling in. We may get all kinds of things going on. You never know what's gonna happen. When the Bass Guy Show goes live right here on Concert Window. Be sure to tip those waitresses. Yes, indeed. Yo, let's give it up for the Bass Guy. <laughs> and not lose that contact because it's good contact it's important because when we die we're going to go on living in another format this guy loves you no fear this
So while while you're on the uh, line with us, there to the needs of others. So my only cry. As janitors, I fall asleep to that all the time. <laughs>